buy it, wait for a sale, skip. Um, so I'll, I'll be real with you. Honest opinion, man, it's worth the buy. Don't get me wrong, it's definitely worth the buy. But I definitely say, like Jesse just said, the whole system is still pretty buggy. Like everything's really buggy. I'm hoping that that we get a major patch when they drop everything else on November 16th. November 16th is when DMZ and Warzone's gonna drop. Here's why I say you might want to save the money. is because DMZ and Warzone are gonna be completely free. So it's totally up to you whether or not you want to drop that much bread. As it currently stands, I bought it, so I'm, obviously I think it's worth it. But from my outside looking in, I'm kind of on the fence to say buy it because they didn't give us all of the features such as hardcore. It's like they just took away weapon tuning because apparently it was unbalanced or something. Is it worth the buy? Seconds? I think it is, but it's seconds. tough. But yeah, man, honestly, it's, it's really good. I'm going on a limb by saying this, but the shooting mechanics and the weapon handling is almost as good That's as Tarkov. Good? Like, like ooh, almost movement, as good as Tarkov. Is... Yeah, no combat record, nothing. But yeah, the, the movement is is good in the game i'm really waiting for hardcore because i don't like shooting people too many times especially there's certain times where it just don't make sense in my opinion the time to kill is a little inconsistent sometimes it's good sometimes it's just hardly inconsistent like that right there you know what i'm saying like he shot me in the shoulder and i proceed to blow his chest off Bruh. and he just still gets the kill 75 kill assists you know what i'm saying like shit like that is like how bro but overall i think this might be the best shooting game we got right now it's just it just is what it is man this honestly might be the best shooter that we got Starkov ain't doing it at the end of the day man like the shooter mechanics are really good actually like the shooter mechanics are really good i'm not gonna lie the scopes the the, the graphics Everything looks really, really phenomenal to me. I think it's really awesome. I think they did a great job with this Call of Duty. And I'm going to be playing it for a while. I'm probably going to hop back on the next Tarkov wipe. But, uh, I mean, man, I'm, I'm looking forward to DMZ and the goddamn... Uh, what? Oh, we got a hacker. We got a hacker in our lobby. This man jumped and was flying through the air and shooting. I just saw the shit. Unless he... Yeah, I swear to God. Un unless he got glitched or something on mistake he's definitely hacking ain't no ain't no way ain't no way man this man flying man he's flying bad? through the air man he's flying through the sky man I that boy took flight that boy said warriors take flight oh you got clapped teammate copy though i just want to get lied to again like battlefield 2042 which i'm glad i never bought you know un unlike battlefield 2042 they did deliver a full game the only thing that's missing is hardcore you know what i'm saying they, they already told us dmz and warzone gonna be in the 16th might get delayed i'm praying that it doesn't knock on wood but th that was already known that was gonna be there yeah the intervention would be nice they do need to add the intervention intervention would be nice to have but yeah that's that's only a few contrivances that i have with the game food gripes you know what i'm saying for the most part, like I said, seven or eight out of ten. You know what I'm saying? I'm just looking forward to hardcore, man. That's it. Oh, it's a teammate. Teammate, what the hell are you doing in there? Ooh, I took my double kill. Thank you.